Come bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord. You that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary and bless the Lord. The Lord who made heaven and earth give you his blessing out of Zion. Thus may the Lord Almighty, our God and Saviour, grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. For our help is in the name of this Lord, who made heaven and earth. As we come to the end of this day, we acknowledge our need of forgiveness. And so we say, most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins. Heal us by your Spirit and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. With the confidence that our requests are answered, we say, before the ending of this day, Creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. Yet before we sleep we long to hear from God in his word and tonight we listen to Paul's words in Philippians chapter 3 verses 13 and 14 where he says Sisters and brothers, I do not think I have yet reached perfection, but I am focused on this one thing. I have set aside what lies behind me. I am stretching out towards the future and my goal is to obtain the prize, God's call aloft in Christ Jesus. The older we get, the greater our store of items gathered from our past. Sometimes we need a clear out. But as well as things, we carry hurts, failures, disappointments and the sorrows that come from our earlier days. Paul knows they can hinder our progress. So he had made a conscious effort to not dwell in the past, to divest himself of those things that encumbered him and to focus on one thing, the pathway that would lead him to his God. Lord God, how very easy it is for us to become backward looking, full of regrets for what might have been, consumed by the hurts inflicted on us, buried beneath the weight of guilt and sorrow. Help us to move forward, difficult though this sometimes is, and to look to you and our welcome home to a time when disappointment, pain and every sorrow will be past. So may the Lord our God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit bless us and watch over us. May the Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. 
May the Lord look kindly on us and give us his peace.